Ayan, at syempre guys, katulad ng pangako ko sa inyo, eto na, kailangan nyo lang pumunta sa dti.gov.ph and then scroll down, puntahan nyo yung consumers, and then hover your mouse over to this complaints. There you go. So, iraraw tayo nyan sa isang page wherein mas makikita nyo kung gaano karami yung saklaw or should I say yung sakop ng, ng DTI um, hindi lang pala sila para sa mga consumer goods or products but of course um, they do handle telecommunications company and different um, different stuff meron din dyan yung bank ng bank financial institutions and syempre Bank Central ng Pilipinas yung nag-handle nyan and many others so ayan ako ang dami diba so nakakatawa Hint, ang Alam ko lang kasi talaga is ang DTI is just for registration of business um, if you would like to complain for a certain product or services so yes, sa kanila ko pupunta pero hindi ko alam na ganito pala karami yung pwede, pwede nilang i-handle So apart from that, um, as you can see when you, once you scroll down, makikita mo how to file a complaint so nandito lahat ng information na yan, yan. Um, and you can go directly doon sa kung saan malapit na branch sa inyo if you're outside Metro Manila if you're within Metro Manila you can um, go to their office directly but before that guys, make sure na tamawag muna kayo para mas mabigyan kayo ng tamang um, steps ng DTI representative okay? so as you can see you'll just have to download the complaint form so pag kinilik mo yan ito yung mag-route sa inyo dito kayo mag-route so you'll just have to download it to your computer so, na-download ko na yan. Meron na akong copy niyan. And as you can see, you'll just have to fill out everything. Your name, telephone number, your email address, your present address, and name of respondents. This is the the party that you're complaining. So, if it is a company, kung tao lang niya, or yung nag-iisa lang niya na business, ganun. So, it depends. Basta ilagay nyo lang lahat ng information na needed. Yung address ng company na kinocomplain nyo, as well as the name of the owner or the manager kung kalala nyo. Minsan natatagpuan naman yan sa website ng company na kinocomplain nyo. Sa causes of action, um, I, I suggest medyo skipan nyo na lang to kasi ang ginawa ko dito, binasa ko talaga yung lahat ng RARA ng DTI. So medyo ma, madugo siya. So what I can suggest is just leave it blank for the meantime. Kasi bahala na si DTI rep yung magbigay sa inyo ng information about this during the arbitration or negotiation. So, of course, yung narration kapag ka sobrang haba, then you can um, create your narration or yung information ng inyong or detalye ng inyong complaint on a separate sheet. So, ganun kasi yung ginawa ko. Proof of evidences, you'll just have to attach. Lagay mo lang rito kung ano yung inattach mo. Kasi diba sabi ko kanina, um, mag-email sa'yo yung DTI representative and they will tell you the next step that you need to do. So, the relief is the resolution that you're looking for, whether it is refund, replacement, or others. So, you'll just have to specify kung ano yung others. Of course, huwag naman bahay at lupa. Pero kung yan yung gusto nyong hingin, depende sa gravity ng um, issue. Okay? So, that's it guys. You'll just have to um, fill out everything here and then you can print this para may sarili kang hard copy and then you can attach this um, including your narration as well as your proof of evidences and then attach it to the email na binigay sa inyo ng DTI representative. Okay?